He can make a spider crawl out of his screen. <laughs> or make the iPad fly like a balloon. German magician Simon Piero has wowed crowds around the world with his tablet trickery. I've always been excited by technology. I had a Filofax when I was 12. I'd enter all these appointments, although I didn't actually have any. I loved doing tricks as well, so I decided to combine the two. You can move the ball around a little. How does it feel, like a tablet? I can make it the right size and bring it out of the screen. I go in here, and then you can easily change it. It's amazing. It's interesting. It's cool. I don't know how to do it. That's what I don't want to know because that would like take away it. But it's definitely. It's cool. It's different from traditional magic in that a traditional magician makes things appear from nowhere, like a coin from behind someone's ear or a tennis ball out of thin air. I combine that with my tablet. I search for eggs and get the right picture, and then make it look like the eggs are coming out of the tablet. But the digital illusions only work because Simon has already mastered some classic magic skills, like sleight of hand. He works with software developer Masashi Beheim to plan his tricks in minute detail. The art of digital magic doesn't work without programming. I can't tell you too much about my secrets, of course. But obviously, I combine graphic representation on the iPad with my sleight of hand via special programming. Here's an example. I always leave my pen here, so I can always get hold of it. Simon, from the city of Karlsruhe, was already a keen performer as a young boy. He got into magic when he was 16. His career took off in 2002 when he was named German Magic Champion. Since then, he's had TV appearances, accolades, and bookings all over the world. In 1998, I set myself a goal. It was straight after I finished school. I was traveling around America with a friend, and our car kept breaking down. He asked me where I wanted to be in 10 years, when we'd be laughing about those mishaps. I wanted to be on TV with millions of people watching my tricks. Simon has been posting videos like this one on YouTube for three years now. They've been viewed by millions of people. Thanks to newest technology, this is absolutely fast. It is cheap and absolutely painless. He's become known as the iPad wizard on social media sites. A few years ago, I couldn't have imagined this. It's not just being able to do things, it's about who you can show. I was lucky to get onto TV shows, but you can't compare that to the effect YouTube, Facebook and so on have had. Simon is constantly working on weird and wonderful new tricks. His stunning performances prove that even in the digital age, people are still fascinated by the power of magic.